Hello everyone, today we'll be going over Blue Shield's new enrollment platform. We titled this enhanced tool our new Off Exchange application system. Today we'll be doing a high level overview going over the basic features of this new tool. Blue Shield of California is excited to release our new individual and family plan enrollment system for our brokers and consumers. The new enrollment system has several new features that streamlines the enrollment process to save you time. For our brokers, the enrollment system offers many new enhancements to increase the ease and speed of submitting applications. We will discuss the enhanced dashboard and all of its new powerful features that provides multiple purposes, such as keeping track of your off-exchange prospects, identifying the status of any off-exchange applications submitted while in process, the ability to add supplemental products such as dental and vision into your client's account, and you, and you can use the client record on the dashboard as proof when dealing with BOR issues and trying to demonstrate you should be the broker of record. We recommend that you add any client or prospect to your broker dashboard, even when the only action you took was sending your broker URL via email to the client. Our consumer site provides the same enrollment experience as the broker site. Customers are able to shop and compare plans, enroll in a plan, and pick their personal care provider. In this video, we will walk you through the new broker enrollment system experience to show you how quick and easy it is to complete an application using our new system. Once you are logged into Broker Connection, click on the Individual and Family menu option to expand the menu. On the drop-down menu, click on the Start Enrollment option. A new browser tab will open. We are now on the new Off Exchange Application System home screen. The home screen displays your recent contacts and applications. Before we move on, let's take a moment to discuss navigation. Along the top navigation bar, we have two menu options, Clients and Applications. Clients allows you to add new clients or view current clients on your list. Applications allows you to start or complete an in-process application. Also, at the top right of the screen, there is a profile button to view your account information and a logout button. Let's begin our overview by adding a new client. First, we click on the Clients link to navigate to the client screen. We are now at the client's main screen. On this screen, we can add a new client or search for existing clients. For example, we will add a new client by clicking on the New Client button. A new client form opens. We will complete the form, including the first name, last name, email, and phone number. Once we're done with the form, we will click Save New Contact button to exit the form. The client details are now displayed on the left side of the page. In the next part of this video, we will continue the process of completing a new application for the client that we have just added. Prior to enrolling a client, you must first add them to your client list. Now, let's continue our example by enrolling our client into a plan by clicking on the New Application button at the top right of the screen. Notice at the top of the screen, there are steps showing the progression of the application process. We are currently at Step 1, Eligibility Information. On the left side of the screen is the Section Progression Information, which provides guidance within each of the steps. Okay, now let's continue to complete the Eligibility Information section. We completed the Get Started section and now continue to scroll down to the next section of the page. As we continue down the page, we see the next section, Who Needs Coverage? We complete this section and when we're done, we click the Next button. Again, notice the top of the page, we've now moved to step two, choose a plan. Here, we can review the available plans in the client's zip code. We can also sort and filter plans using the options on the left side of the screen. 
There is also a compare option available too. You can select up to three plans and compare them side by side. To use this feature, check each desired plan next to the compare button. The plan selected can be compared by clicking view results. Also, you can view the details of any particular plan by clicking view details to expand the menu. Let's expand this plan's details to see the additional information. When we are done, we click the View Details link again to hide the panel. OK, let's choose this plan for our client by clicking the Select Plan button. Notice that there is a little check icon within the Plan Selection button. Next, we will click the Enroll in Selected Plan button to continue to the next step. We are now at Step 3, the Optional Specialty Plan Options. Here, we can skip this step or choose from the options. For this example, we will select the Bundled Plan option and click the Next button. We are now on Step 4, Personal Information. In this section, you will complete the client's address and eligibility questions. First, confirm the initial contact information you entered for Add a New Client. Then continue to add home address information. The home address is validated via the U.S. Postal Service. Select the correct address from the list. We continue to the next section on the page and complete the questions. When we are done with the questions, we click the Next button to move to the next step. In Step 5, we will select a PCP for our clients. You do have the option to skip this step if you choose, and Blue Shield will auto-assign a PCP for your client. There are sort and filter options on the left side of the screen to help you narrow the options to your criteria. For example, we will select this PCP and click the Next button. During special enrollment period, you will need to submit additional documentation to verify your qualified life event. Next, you will complete the special enrollment period questions and scroll down the page to the Upload section to submit your documentation. When you are done, click the Next button to continue to the next section. OK, we are now at Step 7, Reviewing the Application. We now review the information and confirm everything is correct. As we scroll down the page, there are a series of legal information that we must confirm. Read and accept each of these items. Now we will complete the application by filling out the broker signature and checking the verification box and click the next button. Now we are ready to enter our payment information and submit the application. The payment verification is directly performed within the application. We accept the payment terms and conditions and submit the payment. We are now at our final step, step nine. Here we have the option to print the application for our records. There is also a confirmation number that we can reference. To return to the main screen, we click the Exit Enrollment link at the top right of the screen. In this next part of the video, we will discuss how to view existing clients. You can search for a client in the Recent Application section using the navigation keys at the bottom right. To view all clients and to search by a name or number, click the View All Clients link at the bottom left side of the screen. We are now on the client's main screen. Any items showed in blue are links to the client record. For example, clicking on the client ID would take you to the client record. For our search example, we will enter Jones in the search box. Here we see our search results displayed. To view the client record, we click on the client ID. The client details screen provides contact information for your client as well as the application status and history. 
We can also view the application by clicking on the application ID. We are now at the application complete screen. This is the same screen as when the application was submitted. Here we can view and download a copy of the application. When you click the print your application button, a new browser window will open with the PDF copy of the application. You can download or print the application for your record. Close the browser window to return to the new OffExchange application system. Okay, that completes this overview of our new enrollment system. We hope you enjoyed this video and if you have any questions, please give us a call. Thank you for watching and have a great day.